Here we go with conversion between metric and customary unit systems. All right, so that means we're going to be working with the metric system and the customary unit, or what we're used to in feet, pounds, inches, things like that. Here's our problem. The boy weighs 18 kilograms. How much does that weigh in pounds? This is important. Notice it gives you the conversion. One kilogram is 2.2 pounds. We're going to need that. Now, our next question is, when do we multiply and when do we divide? Well, you can imagine this is important to understand. It's very similar to, our sa to the same rule we worked on in other conversions. If we're going from smaller to larger, we divide we're going from larger to smaller, we multiply. Okay, so this is important to put in your notebook. It really is going to help. Now let's check this out. Let's, let's get rid of some of these things. Okay, here's our answer. Whoops. So we're going from kilograms to pounds. Because that's larger to smaller, we multiply. So we just simply multiply the 18 times the 2.2. And then also be aware you've got to enter the unit in your answer. So 39.6 pounds is our answer. Here's another example. We're again converting. This time it's 65 gallons to liters. Notice it says there's that one gallon is 3.8 liters. Important to pay attention. So we have to figure out, all right, we either going to multiply or divide here. Really, we only have a couple of different numbers, 65 and 3.8. So what do we do? In this case, gallons is larger than liters. So we're going from large to small. From large to small, we multiply and get 247 liters. Practice time. Here's a problem for you. Pause the video, work out your answer, then come back and reveal, or watch for me to reveal the answer. Okay, welcome back. Here's the answer. Hopefully, you got 918 square feet, or feet to the second power. It's important to pay attention to the unit on that. Alright, enjoy and get on that pie and master this topic.